Middle East Regional Director for Sales, who is going to be speaking to you this morning. Good morning. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining us here today at the fourth stand at the Dubai Motor Show, where we have a lot to talk about. I'm not going to talk to you about products and specs only. I'm going to also talk to you about a success story. And this is the success story of Ford Motor Company. As you know, Ford has been famous since the beginning of the 20th century for allowing a middle class family to own or drive a car. And today, we continue this legacy by building the best quality vehicles and also after 100 years, providing the latest technology to our mainstream customers by making them very affordable. And this success story of Ford Motor Company has been on Ford both globally and here in the Middle East. And our efforts are being paying off with all these products and the quality of the story you're going to see and the latest technology that we're going to see around us here. The best proof for our success, as you all know, 2009 has been a very challenging year for everybody. And we have all the industries around the world basically has, has been down. And however, we have outperformed all the industries in the US, in Europe, and here in the Middle East by growing our market share in these three most important markets. Here in the Middle East, as you may know, the industry is going to be 20% down by the end of this year, and we are going to be outperforming this industry by around 12%. And I'm sure that all of you know that by third quarter of this year, Ford Motor Company turned a $1 billion net income, which is obviously a great achievement. So this is a very exciting time for Ford Motor Company. And we are very glad to be here with you in this motor show and offer you all this product. Uh, as Alan Monari put it simply when he took the company leadership uh, a few years ago, he said simply, uh, the plan was simply to build the best vehicles on the road and make them affordable to our mainstream buyers. Guess what? We are a great step ahead on this goal and at the same time, we are on our plan for turnaround where we are, like I mentioned, gaining the market share in the most important markets in the US, Europe and the Middle East. Another proof for our success is the quality of our products. As based on the uh, experts in the industry, we are now leading the quality uh, in the automotive industry ahead of all the other manufacturers. Also, and this is based also on JD Power Associates and many others. At the same time, we are leading customer satisfaction where we have far less things gone wrong than any other manufacturer in the industry. Uh, we keep continue with our leadership in safety with the best and most mix of five star safety rating and top quick safety of any other manufacturer. Also, additionally, now we are leading in technology where we have the most the patent technology and any other manufacturer and all this technology are uh, quality and also very significant. Everything I'm going to be talking to you about basically in terms of technology you're going to see here around us and all this and this is basically behind our transformation plan that the company is taking. What you're going to see, you're going to see all this the technology I mentioned on Toros, which is like this all new Toros that arrived just now in the Middle East and to give you an insight of where the company can be headed in the future. If it's from the sophisticated design or the segment leading quality and safety or the outstanding driving dynamics and uh, obviously just exclusive and technology, all this are obviously at a great value. You'll also see the Fiesta, the dynamic little Fiesta, or the dynamic fusion, and the iconic Moscow. Also, we are proud to showcase the Raptor. The Raptor is our mighty F450 SUV uh, pickup, which basically reconfirmed our leadership for the truck and SUV industry. And most of you maybe know about the challenge that we have for all our journalists, where we have 
have uh, a glimpse at the capability of the laptop by trying to simulate it, and we'll be monitoring the scores of everybody, and by the end of the day, the winner will be awarded a nice Raptor uh, prize. It's not going to be a Raptor vehicle. <laughs> okay, I'm going to look at you. Also, uh, in addition to Raptor, we're going to see the MTT, which is the latest from Lincoln, which combined uh, we combine the technology, combine the spaciousness and luxury in one car. But while we're visiting our child, I will encourage you to spend some time on the new EcoBoost engine. And we have with us here Dr. Mazen Hamoud, who will be sharing with us. Dr. Mazen is coming all the way from the US and he is the power train calibration uh, manager for the V6 and V8 engine and the polar power train for the EcoBoost power train technology. He will give us uh, the philosophy behind this high performance and fuel efficient uh, technology which uses gasoline uh, fuel recharge uh, direct inject injection technology to deliver high power with 20% better fuel economy and 15% better uh, CO2 emission. And the uh, EcoBoost actually is going to be the cornerstone of our environmental responsibility and we're going to have it around 1.3 vehicle uh, fitted by 2013 and here for the Middle East the 2011 uh, Taurus SHO Flex and MKT are going to be equipped with this EcoBoost so everything I mentioned about technology and product we are see here on our stand today and I'll give you an insight of where Ford Motor Company is headed in the future and we are pleased with what we have brought and continue to bring to the region together with our peers. And I'm confident that the new models you see here today are going to be another great step forward for Ford.